We should get down to the wolves, brother. Come. Quiet. She is a friend. Now. Better they get this from you. Once the wolves have the scent of the Norns, we'll just need to follow their lead. I will open the gate. Stop whining. Their fur is matted. When did you last brush them? They are wolves. And matted fur leads to disease. Take care of them and they'll take care of you. Brother, what exactly do you intend to ask the Norms? How I may find my son. Nothing more. You don't imagine it's a chance to clear up all this mess about prophecy? Perhaps get a second opinion on your alleged demise. You didn't tell me you had a death prophecy? When Atreus and I reached Jotunheim, we found a hidden mural. The giants, they herself, had foreseen our entire journey long ago. Who we would meet, who we would fight. All of it, as it happened. But you aren't dead. That image was from a time yet to come. I see. You've never struck me as someone who fears death. That's not the problem, is it? No. Death can have me when it burns me. Then maybe it's not the future that bothers you. Faye sent you on your journey, and she made sure you'd see that image at the end of it. And you're still not sure why. I wish to speak of this now. Watch the wolves closely. See how their heads point the way? Well, the Lake of Nine has certainly seen better days. Raiders have made themselves quite at home. Hold. The wolves are distracted.
suspect that's all of them. These were coal raiders. Infamous for Eating them. wolves. Atreus and I rescued ours from such an encampment. That was... kind of you. The coal raiders have been a blight on this land. The way they've abused its creatures. Perhaps we should do so. Perhaps. To you, brother. If the Norns know the future, no doubt they'll expect us to show up a bit later. Sure, I've been back to these parts since our great battle with Sigrun. She speaks highly of that fight as well. You know of that. She told me all about it when she found me. She believed you could be an ally. <coughs> long before I believed it. The Valkyrie Queen. <coughs> an ally. I'm the Valkyrie Queen. As Sigrun was stubbornly determined to remind me. <coughs> I should have guessed it was Sigrun helping you recover yourself. So loyal, wise, clever, tall. Mm-hmm. Doesn't take a love goddess to see where you're coming from. This thread of fate we are tracing. It's not somebody's life, if that's what you mean. The Norns use it to mark their way when they're outside of the well. The Norns live in a well. No. The well of Earth, their home is... hard to explain. It's in no fixed place. Entrances come and go. A place wholly under their influence, where the intangible becomes tangible. Brother, what is it? The wolves cannot focus. Kratos, a raider encampment. Shall we take care of them, brother? Inside your own mind. But if we go in together, are we in? Each other's minds. Not so sure I like the sound of that. of our past can be inextricable from the present. You have to understand that. That must be Tyr's helmet, 
from his statue. Win minds, not wars. Tyr understood the greatest fight of them all was the battle for people's hearts and minds. Too bad Tyr has no interest in doing either these days. Not personally. Freya's right, they have ways of discouraging visitation. Odin made his share of efforts. Wouldn't talk about what he found. Either he gave up, or he wanted to forget what he saw. Freya, you mind telling us what you experienced when you sought the Norns last time? To be honest, the details are hazy. Like waking up from a dream. Mainly, I remember that nothing could be done to change my son. Which only made me more determined to try. The Oarsmen. Ugh. A monument to conquerors. Made some lovely warships, though. <laughs> Brother, what of your story? You faced the fates of your homeland, yeah? The legends I heard about the ghost of Sparta were surely exaggerated. Exaggerated? Oh, not in the brazen bloodshed righteous fury part. The part where it said you traveled back in time itself to win a battle once lost. It strains credulity, obviously. I mean, a rumor about Thor knocking the World Serpent back in history from Ragnarok is one thing. Not now. Never seen craftsmanship like this before. Can't imagine how old it is. Now, where have we seen an artifact like that before? Tales of time travel always strain credulity. It is the truth. The threads of fate span all life and time. The sisters of fate abused their power. When I challenged them, they threatened to undo my existence. So I killed them and turned their power on Zeus. That's the most dangerous and irresponsible thing I've ever heard. These Norns have no such magic, nor does anyone in these realms that I've ever seen. Enough. We will continue later. circle back and close the book on this time travel rubbish. If it existed, Odin would have it. And if Odin had it, he'd be five shades more fucked than we are already. I would not ask them to change the past, even if they could. I only want information. And that's quite dangerous enough, in my experience. Yeah! 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 
Is that a frozen lightning bolt? My fight with Thor ended there. That's where you landed. No wonder there's bits of tear statue all over the lake.
This is the right area, but we can't go further on the sled. What did you find? A list of provisions needed to prepare a meal. A recipe? Who left that way out here? Let's take a look at the ingredients. Perhaps the recipe will lead us to them. I imagine we might find one of those ingredients around here. Ah, I knew I recognized those initials. The Ballad of Yari and Soma. I'm not familiar. An old tale, but a good one nonetheless. The carving marks their passage through this realm. You could always try and find the others if you're curious. and cured me of my appetite. But damn if I can't stop thinking about the smell of tear stew. I wakened a fair few culinary cravings. Then black pudding, haggis and neeps. Oh, porridge and honey. What about you, brother? Any pre-fimble winter foods you're aching for? Olives. The hell's an olive? Another coal raider camp. Kratos, we should do something about them. Ah! 
tired of your lack of empathy for your own wolves. It's Demos, isn't it, brother? I should not have told you, Demos. You see yourself in these wolves, in their fear. Let us keep moving. Isn't that the spear from Tyr's statue? Wish for peace. Be ready for war. Oh, that's astute of you. Tyr never sought war, but he knew he had to be ready for it. Aye, best be armed than not. Impressive looking weapon, isn't it? It is big.
Another coal raider camp. We should do something about them and put your wolves at ease. Kratos, they're chieftains. 
Kratos, their chieftain. Was he the one who captured the wolves before you freed them? I do not know. <laughs> Regardless, they should draw some comfort from his death. Still scared. Not of the Raiders. Do not. Do not be afraid. You are safe. Good. Good boys. Careless. Good girls. We never do seem to get rid of those things.
How strange. I've never seen that building before. Aye. Very strange indeed. Let's take a closer look. <laughs> We don't have the equipment for this. 